Welcome to Fair Hope. Mr. Brown is the principal of our school. He has fun and works hard. Let's hear from him now. Hello, my name is Jim Brown. I'm the principal of Fairhill Primary School and Nursery Unit. This video is going to give you a virtual tour of the nursery and our primary school. And the P7 children are going to explain about life around the school. Fairhill offers a first class education in both our nursery unit and in P1. The children thrive in our friendly nurturing environment and we have excellent records of achievement in both standardised tests and in AQE. We also provide a variety of after school clubs and a lot of extra activities including music, drama and sport. Please feel free to contact the school if you need any more information. Now sit back and enjoy the virtual tour of our nursery unit and P1. Hello, my name is Mrs Andrews and I am the nursery teacher here at Fairhill Primary School. The preschool year for our young children is a fun and exciting year through which they learn to develop their confidence, independence and social skills as they play and explore together. I'm now just going to give you a little walkthrough tour of our indoor nursery building and I very much look forward to meeting with you and your children in September. Okay, so this is our entrance hall to nursery where you will come in in the morning with your child. These are all their coat pegs where they will hang up their coat. And then we come down our hallway where you will bring your child each morning to nursery, right to the doors and pass them over to ourselves. So I'm just going to let you have a little look around the room. We have a beautiful, spacious, big bright room as you can see. This is our snack area where the children come and access their snack. This is over to our water area, our painting and our creative area. These are some of our puzzles, construction, some small world play out on the table. This is the reading area where we sit to enjoy our books and songs. We also have a lovely quiet room where the children can come with me to have their stories and songs and rhymes as well in this little room. I'll take you over now into where our toilets. We have three toilets for the children. There's plenty of space. There is their little taps and sinks that they can use themselves. And I'll let you go back in to the room. This is our role play area, which we have set up at the moment for our nighttime and our bedtime theme. This is our construction and block area. And as you can see, this is our outdoor covered area, which means that we can be outside and experiencing our learning in all weathers. So I'll let you have one last look back around the room.
the nursery pirate ship kind of frame, as you can see behind me. I remember when I was in nursery, I liked playing on it and I made so many friends that day. In nursery, I really loved painting. It was my favorite thing to do. The nursery building is modern and spacious with a pirate themed adventure player and a five meter squared sand pit. In nursery, there was a teddy bear picnic and I brought in my favorite teddy and I really loved it. I remember I loved playing in, in the cubes in nursery, even if I got stuck one time. I was nervous on my first day, but the nice friendly teacher put me to ease and I did not want to leave. You will not regret choosing Fur Hill Primary School. We are looking forward to welcoming you aboard shipmates. You have a long and exciting adventure ahead of yourselves here at Fair Hill. Fair Hill Nursery is the best! Welcome to Fairhill Primary School. I'm Mrs. Watson and I teach Primary 1 and Primary 2. In the early years, we teach through a thematic approach. We cover topics such as dinosaurs, wonderful me, and fairy tales. Here is the resource area which classes use for the role play, play doh, sand, and messy play. Today it is set up for the topic of home, and we have a building site. Next week it will be in estate agents. Learning through play is a wonderful way to engage with the children and for them to learn in a fun and interesting way. We enjoy bringing the learning outdoors where the children can develop their coordination and balance on scooters and the balance beams. Exploring what's in the water tray and drawing with chalk help to develop their pre-writing skills. The classrooms are areas of calm and creativity where the children are encouraged and nurtured in their learning journey at Fairhill Primary School. Routines are established early on, independence is encouraged, thinking of others and learning to be the best we can be is engraved in all that we do. We have a warm and welcoming school where we would love to see your child and every child be happy, secure and reach their full potential. We love to celebrate our pupils' successes and achievements within and out of school and we look forward to welcoming you and your child here at Fairhill. One of my favourite memories of P1 was making gingerbread men with Miss Russell. 
I remember when I was going into P1, um, I was on the verge of crying and I felt really nervous and Josh and Zara came over and played for me and we've been friends ever since. One of my favourite memories from P1 was when we were allowed to sit outside and eat our lunch. We host tournaments here and we do our brilliant sports day here as well. We love P at Firhill. I love playing hockey. This is one of the only full-size astro pitches in the area. As you can see, the kids love playing PE and loads of other games like netball, hockey and even football, as you can see. We love all the sports at Fair Hill, especially tennis. Now we're going to hear from Miss Spout, our Vice Principal. The girls have asked me to tell you a little bit about the Eco Schools Award. From the time that I've arrived at Fairhill Primary School, I've been involved with Eco activities. First of all, we did our Bronze Award, our Silver, and then eventually we got our Gold Award, which really means we get a, a green flag to display outside school. Over the years, we've managed to get seven green flag awards and a couple of years ago we were given the status of Eco Ambassador School and part of that was to do with our activities linked to energy saving and we now have solar panels on the school and before lockdown all the children would have been taking it in turns in different classes our Eco Committee to go around and make sure that people were turning off their lights and saving electricity. We also take part in the Big Bird Watch and the big spring clean, as well as other topics which we incorporate into our everyday activities in the class. So yes, Fairhill Primary School is definitely an ambassador school for Eco. This is our Eco flag. Very few schools in the area have an Eco flag. We are very fortunate to have it. And we also have an Eco club where we do lots of stuff like pick up litter. We have our own mini based hotel and there we create stuff to help the mini beach live a happy life. This is our bug hotel. Here we cater for all bugs so that they don't get squashed or eaten by birds. I love all subjects in school, but I especially like maths. I love doing problem solving, big calculations and investigations. Fair Hill has lots of after school clubs. I really like choir and netball. What's your favourite um, subject? My favourite subject in school is probably art or creative writing. I'm very creative. Yeah, so um, what's your favourite club? My favourite club would probably have to be cross country, I do that, or uh, netball. I really enjoy the after school clubs in Fair Hill. Last year I went to cross country and choir. It was really fun. Here are some girls from the choir. Here at Fair Hill we love to sing and make music. We are all part of the choir. I love singing in the choir. Here the choir enjoys singing at the old people's homes, switching on the Christmas lights and doing concerts. We have iPads and computers in all the classrooms and we have a computer suite. We enjoy using them to help us with our work and to do research. This is our computer suite. We play on the computers and the iPads in here. We also have an internet safety board behind us. It teaches us all about the internet safety and how to keep safe on the internet. We also play websites such as Puckle Mash, Comads Games. They're all fun and enjoyable and educational. This is why we recommend your child to come into our school. I loved our P3 trip to the aquarium. I remember wanting to bring home a pet fish. In P5, we went to WFI and the teacher was Scarlett Robot. 
At Fur Hill, everyone is very kind and helpful. We do not tolerate any type of bullying. If you need any help, go and ask these teachers. This is our buddy bench. If your child ever feels upset, then they can come sit down here and a buddy wearing a yellow cap will come and help them sort out their problems. And to cheer you up while you're waiting, there's a beautiful mini garden. This is what I like about Fur Hill. I like that all the teachers are kind and helpful. Ina is our secretary and she does an amazing job. What's your favourite thing about being the father of secondary? My favourite thing is getting to know all the children from they started in P1 right up until P7. So what do you do here? Um, I do all the computer work. I do um, dinners. Um, well, I answer all the telephone calls. Uh, if your mum rings to give you a message, I give you the message. And how long have you been working here? I have been working in Fairhill from Fairhill opened in, in 1997. But I've also been, I was in Canal before that, so I'm 30 years this year, I'm 30 years in the Education Board. Cool. <laughs> I love Fairhill because I'm part of the People Council. The teachers always listen to all of our ideas and opinions before they make their decisions. If you pick Fairhill for your child, then they will get the chance to be part of the People Council whenever they reach Key Stage 2. 2020 was a strange year for all of us, with highs and with lows, but school has still been brilliant. We hope that you will make Fairhill your number one choice.